All right, and we're recording. Hey gang, Andy here, and I'm here to show off my uh, new acoustic. It's a Yamaha um, FG422 OBB, whatever that means. Uh, basically, it's just your standard uh, dreadnought body with a nice blue finish. I know it's hard to tell because I'm wearing all blue, but yeah, blue guitar, right? So awesome. Uh, pretty expensive. It only cost me about uh, I think 22,000 yen. So about $220 American-ish, so a uh, fairly cheap guitar. I just wanted something to uh, mess around with, you know, in the house. Nothing really too serious, just get myself back in the game, you know. So um, I got this thing, but in addition to getting it, I also have some uh, aftermarket stuff as well, which I'll show you. Got these lovely uh, Grover tuners for about 8,800 yen, so 88 bucks. And I got Tusk Bridge Pins. So, uh, the idea behind this is that it's uh, man-made ivory, and it's supposed to uh, improve sustain and harmonic content and just make your guitar sound a whole heck of a lot better. So, um, my guitar sounds pretty good as it is, and it feels pretty good, but I wanna do like a kind of a before and after compare contrast uh, video with all these aftermarket stuff added to it as well. So um, I'll give you guys some sound samples of it as it is and then I'll add all the uh, aftermarket stuff and I'll still keep the same strings so that way you won't know there's a whole lot of trickery and it's just the uh, aftermarket products and stuff like that. So here's some sound samples. <laughs> So just uh, give you some sound samples there, just to give you guys an idea of what it sounds like. I think uh, it sounds pretty good, especially for the money, as it is right now, but really curious to see what the extra uh, stuff does for it. So yeah, stay tuned for the next little bit where I add on uh, the Grover tuners and all the Tusk stuff. So yeah, stay tuned. <laughs>
So anyway, uh, despite me being a little out of practice, um, yeah, it's definitely, uh, it feels like the, the strings are like new, but keep in mind these are the same strings uh, that I had from uh, before. So I didn't change the strings, the only things that I changed were the pins and the tuners. So I do notice it sounds like the strings sound fresher and just a little bit brighter and just a heck of a lot more sustain on here as well. So that's a definite uh, welcome advantage to this guitar. So um, this is the Andy Zahn. Sign out for now. Thanking you guys for tuning in to this uh, compare contrast video and my other stuff. And I also want to thank you guys for liking with the thumbs, commenting, subscribing, send a few friends to the party. And hey, as always, we'll see you next time. Catch you later, guys. Bye.